This is the way my sewing room looks now. I've already done got started emptying off that shelf there. And I'm going to rearrange it and hopefully do it better. The last time I rearranged it, I didn't do nothing with the shelves. And I think that kind of like helped me keep a bunch of mess going on. So we're going to try this bad baby again. What I've done is I put my thread here and... <laughs> My old jug that has quilt uh, names in them that I got out of a book. And I got my dolls that I made. I'm missing one. I have a boy somewhere, and I don't know. Maybe Emmy got off with it. But I put all my books right there. And those two, these right here down here, is some pictures that I had done of quilts. And then... The old timey quilt books that I used to get in the mail a long time ago, the magazines, and in the corn dog things, I put the material that I had left over from the quilt that I just done, that for uh, my husband's uh, dad. And here I've got different stuff that, um, you know, like right here is um, elastic. And some material and an empty one so I'm doing pretty good on some of it and different little things over here I got my main stuff that I need for what I you know like I use all this stuff most of the time and over in here these I don't but I don't know what to do with them so I'm just gonna leave them and then I got me some material down there and all and then I got my now these right here I put uh, turn the light on Eh, didn't help. But these are here little cases. I put my, my two inch strips and you know different sizes of my strips in it, and I always use them. And I got a rug started with that, so I got to hang on to that. Well, I think I'm gonna start sweeping the floor and getting the big stuff done. Alrighty, I got the sewing machine moved and got all kinds of junk going on here. And I'm fixing to tackle that table there and move it. Ignore my floor. If you could see the trash that I have right there at the door. But you can't. There you go. Now you can see it. But here is my sewing machine beside the door. And I got that all piled up again. But I am working on it. And I'm going to put those two over there underneath the window. But... I got to work on getting that right there out and everything out from underneath the table. And I'm going to move the table right here in front of that right there bookshelf. So that's where I'm going to put that table. So, whew, let's get busy again. This is what my closet looks like now. And going on around, that right there is all scrap material that I've got. So I need to get busy on that. And there's my table. Had a bunch of stuff all over it. And over here. So I'm getting it down. To it looking better. And I got some stuff going out to the shed. So I got that done. So I'm going to continue on with this mess. Get and win with the closet. But all this right here is scrap material and i think i'm going to start concentrating on it and try to get it down or find something to do with it and all but so far this is what i got i think it's looking pretty good and all but i got to take a break and eat and i still got my garbage there so i'm not done yet okay this is the way my sewing room did look so now we're going to take a look at what it looks like now. Remember this spot? All messed up. Looks a whole lot better now. 
And my closet does too, believe it or not. I got some stuff out there for Rick to put in a shed. And all. I don't know what I'm going to do with that tree yet. I don't know. But anyway, I have started going through the scraps. They're right there and right there. But other than that, I like the way the room turned out. And uh, I hope I'm going to be more happier with it. I am still putting little things here and there. But as far as I'm concerned, I am done. I can find things, you know. I think it's going to be a whole lot more easier. I do have a lot more room, though. I like it better this way. So I'm happy with it. So I'm going to go through that. All these right here, and I'm going to separate them all and keep my strings, you know. Like, I have a bunch of these where you cut them off the corners and stuff, hems and stuff like that. That right there make a good rug. But i got to get enough of them up, which I think I've got enough. But I don't know. I'd rather make sure i got more than what i got there and find them and put them together. But all right, I hope you enjoyed this one. And we're going to get back to sewing here in a little bit.